Hey everyone, I'm Dave. Today we're going to be talking about what's inside a vacuum. Uh, with vacuums, everyone thinks they're this complicated device. It's really nothing much to a vacuum. Um, basically what you're having is a blower. It's sucking air from one area and blowing it out of another. And to prevent the dirt from going into the suction part, you have some kind of filter bag. And if we open it up, and it doesn't matter what kind of vacuum you have, whether you have a, an upright canister, same principle for them all. We're gonna open this up, and we're gonna see there's your cord coming in, your switch, and it doesn't get much more simpler than that. Locking screw on the cord, you always have to have the screw, this cord locked, so that way someone can't pull it. That's the same in pretty well any device. There's our plain, simple electric motor. And there's your blower. And all you're doing is you're sucking air into the center. And as this spins, it's blowing the air out, outside. It's coming out inside the cavity, blowing across the motor. If we're seeing a lot of dust on there, it just basically means the filter wasn't properly sealed because what you want, the whole idea is, you want to seal and prevent dirt from getting in here. And that keeps the motor clean, keeps your blades clean, and keeps all your vents clean, and keeps everything working the way it should. So don't be afraid to open up your vacuum if it's no longer working. It's going in the garbage anyways. Why not take a chance, learn a little something, possibly figure what's gone. Most times the part is not the cost, it's really the labor. And if you're opening up yourself, labor's free. Thanks for watching. If you have any comments again, leave them below, and we'll see you next video.